I'm sorry, mom. Yes, you did. Anyways, okay, so check it out. Tomorrow's Christmas Eve. I got a lot of stuff to do. One, oil change. Two, I gotta get my best friend's gift. Oh, that's my food, not a big deal. And um, what else do I need to do? Oh yeah, I gotta go visit my parents. I was thinking about you guys, don't worry. Fabian's family, I think, is doing something, so I wanna go to that. And then I'm gonna, and then I'm meeting with a friend and making them dinner. So it should be pretty a pretty productive, busy day. I'm gonna reminisce on this and see if I actually did any of it. Uh, hopefully I do all of it. I right, just got up. Christmas Eve, it's official. Let's get ready. Let's, let's get ready, you know, and try to get everything done. Leftovers. So I also forgot. I also do this thing for quitting every year. It's kind of an unofficial, official kind of tradition where we each get each other Blu-rays. Now, that's easier said than done because him and I, well, I cut back, but him and I have a shit ton of fucking Blu-rays. And every year, you know, we get each other fucking Blu-rays. And so it's harder and harder because one, we have to ask each other, did they get this movie? And two, we gotta be like, do they like this movie? And this, and three, is this the best version of the film on Blu-ray? So, I'm gonna have to go to Best Buy. I wanna be there very shortly, but that shit's not gonna happen. I already know that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be that fucking weirdo that's parading up and down the fucking Blu-ray aisle. Looking. Look, you wanna see an example? I'll show you right now. Watch, take this shit out. I'm gonna be like this. I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna be like, oh man, this movie is sick. Ah, oh, but you know what? It's not the, it's, it's, it's not the director's cut, you know? It needs to be the director's cut, you know? And I'll be like, oh shit, this is the director's cut. But then I'll be like, oh dude, look at the box, dude. There's a steel book out, or there's a digi book version of this, you know? And just because of that, I'll be like, you know what? Put this shit back, bro, put this shit back. And then I'll look and I'll be like, oh wait, what? One comes with an extra disc with features? I'm like, I gotta give him that version. Come on, man. I'm not a good friend if I don't give him the right version. So you're gonna see me, you know, looking like a fool. And I don't even know if they'll let me record in there. We'll see. Anyways, um. Parked in the VIP, baby. Everybody in my party is VIP. Hey. I feel like I got cheated. All right, I got the gifts. Easy. Easier than I thought it would be. 
Yeah, I'm recording my whole day. So yeah, pretty much. You're right. On the money. Today's crazy, man. <laughs> Three dollars a gallon over here. Hey, y'all, I was gonna throw up on the way, but I'm like, nah, I'm gonna wait till I get home to fill up. Anyway, so uh, surprisingly, Quinn wasn't uh, that hard to shop for. I it was in and out. I thought I was gonna pray it around, like I said earlier, but you know, there was the Equalizer Steelbook, and he's a Denzel fan on the Erasers and uh, Zombieland. This is it's a sick ass cover. Like, how could you hate this cover? Covers on point, you know what I'm saying? And then I like the art, even though I don't like the movie. I'm not gonna lie. One thing done, I'm glad it's out of the way. On to the next. Alright. Pit stop number two is my roommate's gift. You knew, bro. You're not gonna get this shit. Alright, just got home. Got most of the errands done. You know, I'm gonna take a little break and then head out to my dad's later. But right now, what I'm gonna do, <sighs> play a little bit of that fallout, you know what I'm saying? Play a little bit of that fallout. All right, so I woke up from my nap. It was like more like a five hour nap. Uh, I called my parents, wished them a Merry Christmas. Uh, I was supposed to be cooking throughout this whole day, but I talked to a friend of mine and they were like, well, I don't, I'm don't. i gonna be gone all day and, uh, and I'm not gonna be home till really late. And at my house, they're cooking like crazy, or were, and so I couldn't use that kitchen, so I had to resort to takeout. So, especially on the holiday, you know, where, you, you know what you gotta get, bro. Gotta go for that Lucille's. <laughs> And on a side note, I know you people are looking at my jacket, especially one of my coworkers, because uh, they wear like this huge fucking jacket to work because they over exaggerate on how cold it is. Before anyone says anything, oh, this shit won't focus for shit. Before anyone says anything, I forgot my sweater at work. So, and I only wore this sweater like two times in my life. So, yeah. It's pretty nice though, huh? Check it out. 